Last time on AF, the old Saiyans appeared in front of Goten, and as they spoke, the boy understood that they just wanted to fight. But with the tremendous difference in power between them, Goten was not only defeated but dealt a mortal wound. An unprecedented crisis comes to the Earth, and this is just the beginning. It turns out the old Saiyans aren't as peaceful as initially thought. Imagine that. However, their destructive nature doesn't come from evil itself, but the mere lack of empathy for sentient life. With Goten quickly fading away, how will Trunks handle the situation? <laughs> Holding his best friend in his arms, Trunks can't understand it. He's never met anyone like this guy before. Who doesn't really know what he can say about that? He simply utters, what can I tell you? Letting his anger return, the son of Vegeta spouts that the Saiyan mentioned that they live in search of strong people. After so many fights, surely he's met a few individuals who didn't like to fight. So what then? How did they handle those situations? Leading to Nas ruffling his eyebrows again. The new Saiyans really do ask a lot of weird questions. But to answer either way, whether it's of your own will or for your own survival, most will do just about anything to survive. Their opponent's thoughts are no concern to them on the matter. That's just what being a Saiyan is. Meaning to Trunks, in other words, they have to fight. Which is precisely the case. The weak don't matter. Though the invader also wants to know. That person, why does he hold him? It's no longer useful for anything, is it? It'll just end up getting in the way, so it's better to get rid of it now. Snatching Goten away before he has any idea what's going on, Trunks pleads with him to stop as there's nothing he can do. Goten is completely destroyed. How could these monsters do this? What's wrong with them? The situation dawning on him more than before. These guys can't be real. This video is sponsored by BetterHelp. BetterHelp's mission is to make therapy more affordable and accessible, and this is an important mission because finding a therapist can be really hard, especially if you're limited to only the options available in your area. BetterHelp is a platform that makes finding a therapist easier because it's online, it's remote, and just by filling out a few questions, BetterHelp can match you to a professional therapist in as little as a few days. Check out the link in the description to see how easy it is to sign up and get matched with a therapist. BetterHelp.com slash MondoCool of course, clicking that link helps support this channel, but it also gets you 10% off your first month of BetterHelp so you can connect with a therapist and see if it helps you. And because finding a therapist is a little like dating, if you really don't fit with that therapist, which is a common thing with therapy, you can easily switch to a new therapist without any additional cost without stressing about insurance, or who's in your network, or anything like that. But in all seriousness, there's really no stressing how important mental health is, and I know a lot of people can relate that some people need therapy for X, Y, or Z, in others, things just add up over time to where you have a bad day at work, something happens in traffic, and you know, the horrible things that happen throughout the years with our families, like myself, I've lost my father, three grandparents, I've lost, uh, it's just how life goes unfortunately, and you do have to keep going forward, and BetterHelp can help you do that. So if you're struggling, consider online therapy with BetterHelp. Click the link in the description or visit betterhelp.com slash mondocool. Thanks again to BetterHelp for supporting this channel. Nas quips that he can move around easier now, can't he? Now they're ready to fight. Does the boy understand? Furious, Trunks grunts that he's going to. He's going to make them pay for what they did to Goten. But why is he getting so angry? He helped him remove that obstacle out of his way. transforming into what could be Super Saiyan 3 Rage. Even if it takes everything he has, the Saiyan of Earth promises to destroy him. 
who is joyfully elated to see his awesome new strength. He has way more energy than the other guy from before. Then he takes note of something. The new Saiyans seem to turn anger into power, something he and his kind apparently don't do and haven't encountered before. He's so excited about this, as are the others it appears. Rushing to the battlefield as fast as he can, Gohan can sense his brother's key, or lack of. And now Trunks' key has grown a lot. What's happening? He's gotta go faster. Without anything else to say, Nas wants to get this started. Looking on, Grippy takes a liking to this new Saiyan. He's showing a level of power and tenacity they had given up on finding here. scraped up after that blast. The pseudo-villain grins that this new foe managed to surprise him. However, our protagonist doesn't return the same jubilance. Nah shouts over that after the first guy, he had begun to worry if this wasn't going to be a good battle. Now that he sees it is, he wants to see just how far he can push him. He requests that they increase their power a little more. And a reminder, he's asking the boy not to disappoint him. But what? Don't tell him! Powering up to what could be considered stage two of his evolution. The Fiend doesn't want to turn this into a break in the battle, urging Trunks to bring it right away. Although this is really bad for a protagonist, judging by the look on his face, this puts Nas well above his own limit. He knew that by transforming, he could face him again, even turn this fight lopsided. Just how much power is he still hiding? Trunks out, he falls from a Super Saiyan form. It's the end. What a pity. The old Saiyan admits that he thought he would hold out longer. But if he can't move, they may as well get on with it then. him in his tracks. Gohan arrives just in time. Not at all upset by his arrival, Nas happily greets him. Curious who this is now. Not responding, Gohan immediately kneels down to attend to Trunks. He apologizes for being late, but he had to stop by Korin's to get some Senzus. Thanking him. It does the trick, likely saving his life. Another thing that appears to surprise their unwelcome visitor. He's already got all his energy back. 
when Gohan bluntly drops the feared question. What's wrong here? Where is Goten? Uh, Goten... Goten is dead! With Trunks dropping the bomb on Goten's older brother, will the two of them together be enough to stand up against this horrible foe? Even if they outmatch him, will the other two old Saiyans decide to join in on this battle?